I welcome you all in Jaipur International Art and Calligraphy Festival. And I'm very thankful to Mr. Raza and Mr. Maksud who actually conducted this Jaipur International Art and Calligraphy Festival. The reason of appreciating those people in their arts is just to motivate them and to motivate who are actually trying to live their passion. We are trying to motivate these artists and all those people who think they are not being appreciated. Every art needs a little bit of appreciation because that appreciation works like a motivation for them. We have taken a lot of interviews of those artists who are successful and some are trying to become successful. I wish a good luck for all those artists who have come on our channel and shared their journey with us. So let's welcome all those artists who have come to Jaipur International Art and Calligraphy Festival and introduced their arts. So let's talk about all those artists and let's know what art actually they are showcased in Jaipur International Art and Calligraphy Festival. Okay, hi guys, now uh, our next guest is from Morocco, uh, Ms. Safa. So let's start the conversation with uh, Safa, directly from Morocco. So very welcome Safa on our show. Uh, you welcome. Uh, my name is Safa from Morocco. Um, uh, Safa, what is the name of your art? Wafan uh, Islami. Islamic art. It's Islamic. Fan Islami. يعني تحديدا خط عربي مغربي. وزخرفة مغربية. And illumination Moroccan. Uh, who uh, motivated you to do this particular work? Illumination <laughs> The Moroccan illumination is more difficult and more different also uh, the illumination, other illumination because it's uh لأن تختلف في الألوان في الشكل الشكل الأوراق the design of the motifs والخط المغربي كذلك مختلف عن الخط المشرقي different another calligraphy it's ما عدا خط الثلث المغربي مستوحى من الثلث المشرقي. Unless the ثلث مراكيون different also and beautiful. Okay, so uh, uh, the painting which uh, uh, basically I am seeing right now, it is so beautiful. Ah. What type of material you have used uh, to make this particular painting? I used the gold color. I used the gold color. And water color. And water color. And she made the paper. Okay. So what type of paper actually you used to make that particular painting? Is it normal paper? Is it normal paper? ورق ورق معروف في الزخرف المغربية. A kind of paper she made it exactly to the Moroccan illumination. وهو يعني أسلوبي. يعني. And that's their style. يعني she has made it. Okay. يعني. أخذت الأساس و وبعد يعني صار عندي ستايل. Yeah, she have her style. Okay. So what response you are getting for your paintings? شو يحكي؟ شو الهدف من هذا؟ In Morocco. هي عبارة عن مخطوط قديم. It's a manuscript. Art manuscript. وأنا ب بستوحى من المخطوطات القديمة المغربية الموجودة الموجودة في المخازن والمكتبات المغربية الكبيرة في المغرب. Can found that in many library in Morocco. وأقوم بتصميم جديد مني. And she makes a new design in it. لكي أعطيها طابع جديد. To keep it in modern design. في هذا العصر. ولكي أي مشان 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 الأجيال تشوفها بشكل غير القديم. 
uh, the young people see it, not like the old people who see it. تشجع حالها ان ان انه هالفن ما يموت يعني يستمر. To be uh, always uh, on uh, on the stage and on the, our life without uh, releasing that. What future actually you see uh, when it comes to your painting or your artwork? We في مستقبل هذا الشغل تبع. ايوه بشوفوا يعني من من قدام يعني في المستقبل راح يزدهر والاجيال بت ما بتخلي هذا الفن يموت يعني بضلوا متقدم من جيل لجيل. She said that the young people who come nowadays uh, they like that kind of art and they want to learn it. So she proud of that thing and she want to teach anybody who want to learn this. Okay. So are you are you like uh, running any institute of your work? In the studio, you are working in a special place. Uh, at some place, you are doing this job. Ah, ah, ah. There is a house in the atelier. Atelier. فيه باش باش تشتغل فنون تشكيليه فن الخط فن الخزف فن ستوديو شي ورك ان ذا كاليغرافي اند الومنيشن اوكي سو ذات مينز يو ار جيتينغ ا جود ريسبونس اوف يور ورك فروم ذا اودينس اند ذا يو يعني في بتحس انه في دعم من الاهل والناس اللي حوالينك لهذا الشيء اللي انت بتعمله نعم اه في دعم كثير يعني من من الناس اللي القريبين مني اساس آه يعني الاساتذه تبعي وحتى بلدي بي بيحضروا بيحضروا مسابقات جوائز معارض and make uh, always uh, exhibition for a new festival and to اه واحكي له انه الملك تبع بلدي عامل جائز جائزه 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 لفن الزخرفه المغربيه على الورق كل عام بتكون every year okay that means the work which you are doing is being supported by your government your people so guys see the work which actually safa has shared with us so guys i request you to uh, support safa in the work which is being done by because it is very beautiful and it needs a lot of hard work a lot of patience a lot of dedication so if you like this video please share with your friends and family and you can you may also subscribe our channel and hit on the bell icon for receiving all the notifications of our next videos thank you so much safa for coming you're on our welcome. show thank you so much you're welcome